This is my micro soapbox tricopter that I built last night. I've used these soapboxes on my last tricopter with success, so I was coming up with the design for this tricopter and I figured it would work good enough for the frame. So I built this tricopter for practicing my line of sight because practicing my line of sight flight with my big tricopter doesn't go over too good because it's got the FPV equipment and the GoPro on it, so if you crash messing around it, pretty much explodes. So I built this little thing for getting my line of sight skills up to a par. So I got the soap dish is the frame, and I got some half inch by quarter inch basswood as the arm. I think this is nine inches across. I think this piece on the bottom, I don't remember how long that one is. But we got a metal t uh, tail servo there. Uh, the standard kind of RC Explorer style tilt mechanism. Um, Hobby King 1811 motors. ACP 530 by 3 props. And then inside here, I got an FR Sky Receiver. That's kind of big. I might get one of their four channel micro ones. And you can see the KK2 under there. <clears throat> and then the speed controls are Turner G Plush 6 amps. Um, just today I picked up the landing gear. I think they're off a uh, Blade 300 or something. I don't know, but they're about the right size and they work good. Just screwed to the bottom. These are held on by screws going in from inside. Two in there. And then there's two in that one, but obviously they're coming out from the other side so you can't see them. Um, but yeah, I just got it built last night. Um, dialed in my settings and it's flying pretty good. It's a little bit more squirrely than my big tricopter. But I guess that's nice because you can do some more crazy stuff with it. Um, I like to eventually do some flips and stuff with it, but I'm not quite there yet, so. Well, that's the little tricopter. Let's go fly it.